Hello everyone, welcome to Eurogamer, my name's Ian Higton and t today is the day I'm allowed to show off Halo, the Master Chief Collection multiplayer. The embargo for the multiplayer or the multiplayer content lifted one minute ago. Um, but at the moment, uh, I can't, it, we can't get online with it. There's, um, I don't know whether there's server problems or not, but um, uh, it's it's just hanging on the download latest uh, matchmaking data screen uh, even though uh, there should be some uh, developers on there playing the game right now so that uh, us lot can review it whatever that's not happening it's it no one no one's here the servers are not switched on I forgot to flick their switch or whatever uh, so what I'm gonna do instead is I'm gonna give you guys a map tour uh, I'm going to tour all the new maps, or all the uh, old maps, or the recreations, or the anniversary editions of the maps. I'm going to um, tour the new Forge mode. I'm just going to show you exactly what kind of multiplayer content you guys are going to get. So feel free to ask me questions, request me to check something out. I'm just going to go through, if you're watching this video uh, not live, I'm going to try and go through all the maps in order. So Halo 1, Halo 2, Halo 3, blah, blah, blah. Um, and I'm just going to go, I'm going to have a quick walk around each one, check them out and see see what they all look like. Then I'm going to jump into forge mode and try building something rubbish. So uh, yeah, just quickly um, trying to find a game in the multiplayer. It's not happening. Uh, hello Gavin UK86, hello Paul Burbridge, hello Bolting Venom82, hey Miss Fraggle Rocks, hello MD Production07, 86 and Mad Hatters here, so's Raven TD46, so's My God, so's The Rational Motive, and Sean Mason, and John Above87, and Tyrion Targaryen, uh, Chris O'Neill's here, Stevie Mac, Youngy Young, uh, Dylan Kamardell, uh, who else? Uh, we got some idiot that I banhammered. We got Baybok, Bayok, and some more as well. Welcome one, welcome all. Uh, so there's no multiplayer games running at the moment. Uh, at least I can't connect to any. I've downloaded the update and everything. So what I'm going to do is, uh, as I said, I'm going to go into custom games. I'm going to check out the maps. Uh, from each one. You've got maps from Halo uh, Combat Evolved, Halo 2, Halo 3, Halo 4. Halo 2's got the Anniversary Edition maps where they've got some um, maps that have been reimagined for the Anniversary Edition. So they're going to be exciting to look at. But first we're going to go and check out the uh, Halo Combat Evolved maps starting with um, Battle Creek. There's 19 maps. Maybe I won't show off all 19 maps if they're not um, completely redone. Especially if they take a long time to load. If they take a long time to load, then I'm definitely not going to show them all off. So here we go. Battle Creek. It's the first map we're going to be looking at. Hey, it's uh, Owen. Please show Ford, says Bay Rock Bark. I will, I will. Hey, FR Player 1. Hey, Lally Old 25. Hey, Procrastination Station. So... This is what uh, Battle Creek looks like, Battle Creek from the first Halo. You're going to be able to play multiplayer games on all of these maps, of course, in separate different playlists. What you notice is they haven't really had that graphical upgrade that the um, the the actual, you know, the games, the the the, the campaigns have had. Uh, they have had a HD overhaul, but that's about it. They're very, they all look very basic, don't they? Um, you're not going to... These ones aren't going to have been uh, updated. And they're not going to have had anything added to them. They're going to look exactly as you remember them in your mind's eye. You know when you play games... You, you remember a retro game and then you go back and you play it and you go, oh, that's a lot worse than what I remembered it looking like. This is like uh, playing the game in your mind's eye. Um, and it's, uh, yeah, it's an exact recreation of Battle Creek from Halo Combat Evolved. So that, that's Halo Battle Creek. Let's try the next game one. Over. Game over. Show us the other skyboxes. Well, there's a skybox. Chris O'Neill wants to see them all. I'll try and go through them as quick as I can then. I won't take too long on each one. Just so you guys can get an idea of uh, what they're going to be, what all the maps are going to look like when you play them. 
it's just the uh, the uh, the loading times are quite long. So um, I wonder though if I could make a playlist. Rusters, who's in there? Um, options. You may be, I don't know. Can you make a rotation of the maps? You can choose the game types. So you can have Slayer, King of the Hill, Oddball, Race. Um, but it doesn't look like I can build a um, build a playlist doesn't matter, we'll keep going. So this is Sidewinder next. So yeah, um, uh, it's Owen, he says, yes, he got it right, no one ever does that. I knew someone called Owen whose name was spelled like that, so we're all good. We're all good. I take it they didn't remaster the multiplayer maps, Fine. says Gavin UK. They didn't remaster, they remastered about six from Halo 2 uh, Anniversary, which I'll be showing off a bit later. So this is Sidewinder, quick look at Sidewinder. Can't boost on this ghost. We'll boost on ghost something that happened later on. So Sidewinder again. It's not um it's not remastered. It's just retextured, maybe re HDified a little bit. We'll go up, we'll go up the tower quick and then I'll uh, check out the other one. But yeah, there's um There's some long loading times in between these levels, so uh, I'll be reading out a lot of comments. So let me know what you guys think as we play. Look at that old school sniper rifle. So yeah, you go. Sidewinder played many a match on Sidewinder with um, land matches. Well, wow. and a teleporter there as well. So that's Sidewinder. Let's get on to the next one. What's that do? Leave. Uh, hey, Jump Spark. Do 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 do. Show us Blood Gulch. Says John Above 87. I'm gonna go through each one. Blood Gulch is my favourite map um, on uh, the first Halo. Uh, Sean Mason. Hey, Drunk Doggy. How you doing, sir? We've got um, 107 people watching at the moment. Welcome one, welcome all. If you're new, subscribe. I'd be much appreciated. If you're not new, give the video a thumbs up. You know the drill. I won, Slayer. Right. Next map to look at is Damnation. Let's go. Try and speed this up. Get through as many. Get through these as quick as poss as possible. It's like 19. Nice little overview of each map as well. Little little map of the map of the map. Oh. Looks nice to me, says Chris O'Neill. Sam Moore says, that nostalgia. Yeah, definitely good for nostalgia. Wow. Old school. Definitely good for nostalgia. And, um... It's going to be cool having multiplayer matches on these old maps. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to doing some community live streams and playing against you guys on these maps. Crazy gun is that? What is this? Flamethrower? I don't remember a flamethrower being in Halo. And did I forget? There must have been one. Ooh, those grenades. Oh, I don't remember it. Okay, so. Damnation there. That's how damnation looks in. In the past and now in the future as well. Right, let's get this. Let's get out of here and get into the next one. Oh, the memories, says Chris O'Neill. Stephen Max says I was never a fan of Halo, and this does seem a bit of a cheap way for them to make more money off their old games because the new ones aren't good as, as good as the competition. Well, I don't know. Um, I wasn't a massive fan of Halo 4 to be honest, but um, uh, you're getting a lot of content here for the price of one game. This is uh, the Master Chief Collection is pretty awesome uh, in my humble opinion 
Uh, it's got some faults. There's some. It's a bit juddery graphics-wise occasionally, but that might have been fixed uh, with that recent patch. I've not tried. Um, but no, it's, I think it's. I think it's pretty good. I'm happy with it. What was this rat race we're checking out now? Rat race. I think the old one's going to be the most fun to actually play due to the lack of visual distractions, says Raymond Franklin. Slayer. <clears throat> so here you go, Rat Race. I actually remember Rat Race. This is what Rat Race looks like. Guess so called because you're in loads of tunnels. I wonder if this one was like a DLC or something, because I really, I really don't remember it. Or it just wasn't one that I enjoyed playing. It's very small, actually. That's what she said. So, Rat Race. Not much to see. Very small arena. Should be good for some... Uh, some crazy shootouts, though. Let's leave and get on to the next one. I'm so jelly, says Tammy Sims. Sorry, Tammy Sims. It'll be with you soon. <clears throat> so, shout out to Tammy Sims. Hello to FTW Winnick. I missed that flamethrower, says Chris O'Neill. Flamethrower was exclusive to the PC version, if I recall correctly, says uh, Sam Moore. Ah, Flamethrower is PC only. That's why I don't remember the Flamethrower. I didn't play it on the PC. I only played it on the original Xbox. Right, next map is... Prisoner. I remember Prisoner. Let's go. Go, go, Prisoner. Hotball. So much Halo knowledge in the chat, says Ms. Fraggle Rocks. Hello, Zat Owner X. Oddball. Oddball. So, Prisoner. I remember Prisoner. This is one of our favourite ones to play. I don't remember that lighting up. You cannot switch between uh, old school, new school, or whatever by Rainbow. pressing the back button like you can in the campaigns. Yeah, I used to have a lot of um, lot of shootouts on this map. I really enjoyed uh, really enjoyed playing um, multiplayer matches on this one. Um, this was definitely a LAN a LAN match favourite. Go and get the oddball LAN party favourite even. Yeah. Can I make that gap? Yeah. Here we go. We've got a sniper. Where's the oddball? There's the oddball. There you go, the oddball. I threw it. I throwed it! I throwed it good! And it bounces down. So there you go, that's what Sidewinder looks like on the Halo the Master Chief. Sidewinder? Prisoner? Looks like on Halo the Master Chief Collection. Hey all! Oh, heard that Slayer announce the first thing and I miss it, says Accurate Bob. Um. Please show us the other two Skybox only Forge maps, says Baybok Bark. I'll get to Forge. Um, I will get to Forge Baybok Bark, but I'm going through the maps first. Rat Race was PC only as well, I believe, says Chris O'Neill. Okay, so we've got all the got all the PC only content in here as well that um, Xbox owners never got to play, which is cool. Hang them high next. Daniel Schweitzer says potato. Hey, a 2003 WRX. Ah, so many memories, says Peter Gray. Chris O'Neill's a hardcore uh, Halo fan. He's here checking out the maps. Adball. This is another. This is another land party favourite. Oh wow! I'm getting some crazy, crazy like battle memories of like epic battles on this level. Oh, excellent. I am really looking forward to playing uh, some community multiplayers with you guys on these. This is going to be sweet. Boom! Boom! 
I tell you what, they don't they don't make these maps like they used to, do they? Wow! I remember this so well. Oops, I fell off. It's okay, I got some health. Nice. Well, good stuff. Get out of it. Leave hang him high. Let's get on to the next one. Sean Mason, I reckon sword base was a different map. Yeah. Shame all these maps aren't across all games and the differences would be the way each game plays. Not sure about I I understand. These are all different like they're all again they're all across different games, so they will play a bit differently. The Halo uh, combat evolved multiplayer you'll need to find health packs um, but you won't in like Halo 2 and Halo 3, Halo 4 and stuff like that um, you know the Halo 4 multiplayer will have perky things and you know so each each um, each game's multiplayer will play differently to the others I'm going to have a look at chill out now, chill out, how am I doing for time I'm doing ok for time Hang em High had a beautiful remake in Halo Reach. This is Chris O'Neill. Really? I don't remember the remake of Hang em High. I'll have to check that out. Rat Race was on the original oh, Xbox, says uh, Chris Stables. Ah, I really don't remember it. So here you go. This is Rainbow. Chill Out. Another small arena with some high vantage points. Oh yes, I remember that rocket launcher. Yes, yes, I remember. Perching up here, wiping people out. This one's had a remake, hasn't it? I'm pretty sure this one had a remake in one of the games as well. So, teleporte to the chill out room. <laughs> So this is chill out, nice, nice purple, and full of the nostalgias. Why can't, why can't rockets go through the teleport? Right? Okay, right, leave. Next map. Do you know anything about the Far Cry 4 level editor yet? Ian says drunk Dougie. I know nothing, sir. I'm afraid uh, they're being very tight-lipped, which uh, doesn't fill me with confidence. Can you play uh, bots with this, says Paul Burbridge? Good question. I'm not sure. What's your favourite Halo map of all time, says Daniel Schweitzer? Probably uh, uh, Blood Gulch, I think. Halo 1's maps just had a certain spark, says Chris. Thought it had the remastered and original multiplayer of all the games, says John Bob 87. I don't know. Oh, I've got oddball. So, what's next? Chill out. Derelict. Derelict, my. <laughs> There's Blood Gulch. We're coming up to Blood Gulch. We're de derelicts first, though. Um, can you have bots? Let's have a look at the options. Player options. Invisible players. No, you can have invisible players. Say what? Um, team for options, gear options, vehicle options, item options, king rules. I uh, don't think you can have bots. Go okay. derelict. <laughs> Cold storage was cool. Says Bux Tator. Cold storage. That's that one. Right. This one, this one I don't remember. Looks like it's a circular arena set in the space. Let's have a look out the window. It's probably got a remastered sky. It's looking pretty spacey. It's looking pretty Kevin Spacey. Not 
too much else to see here though. It looks like um basic circular arena. Probably gonna be some ferocious battles in here. Let's keep going. Do a blood gulch tour, start with the original and move through each iteration so we can see progression first hand, says James T. George. Kind of a good idea. Do da do, do I haven't played any Halo game, I'm considering getting an Xbox One. Is it worth it? Says Mix Alice Red Seven. Yes, definitely. Defo. Very worth it. 159 people watching. Hello there, all 159 of you. If you're brand new, make sure to subscribe for more early gameplay previews of unreleased games just like this one. And uh, loads of other stuff as well. Loads of loads of funsies. Loads of cool stuff goes on here. Right, next was Chad Derelict. Boarding action. Start boarding action. If you just joined us, what I'm doing here is I'm going through, I'm just giving you guys a quick tour of every single map that is available on the Halo Master Chief uh, collection. This is boarding action. I seem to remember boarding action. King of the Hill. King of the Hill. Oh, I've got him King of the Hill for some reason. That's why that thing is hanging around. So, boarding action. This one was with the original Halo. And almost 100%. I've definitely played it. I have memories of playing it. Anyway. Oh, God. Oh, I fell into space. <laughs> Look at me swimming. Can you actually get across? Is there a bridge or something? Can you remember? I can you remember. Oh, there's a portal here. Here we go. Well, no, I think I'm on the other side. I'm on the red team side. We boarded, yo. So we get the idea with this one. Pretty nice. Big drops. Two spaceships boarding each other. Lots of sniping and shooting rockets at each other's on the opposite sides. All good. Let's move on to the next one. <clears throat> Sub because you said so, says Bucks Tater. Awesome dude. High five for Bucks Tator for subscribing. You rule, man. Awesome dude. Thank you very much, sir. We're carrying on going. Let's keep on keeping on. Right, next up after boarding action is. Chiron TL34. Bought a new external hard drive just for this, says Daniel Cliftland. What is the new unlocks pop up in the bottom right of the screen that shows up after you leave a game, says BT Poncho? Um, that's uh, when you. You have like customization options and stuff from the single player game. And I think when you do stuff in the game, uh, you can unlock customization options. And those that's just telling me that I've unlocked a new customization option. So Chiron is the uh, the, the crazy teleporty one, which is loads of teleporters and very tight rooms. Again, basic graphics and basic level layout. But funsies, nevertheless. Moving on. Game <clears throat> over. Never got to play boarding action with more than three people, says G Dell. Well, that's good because now uh, with this game you probably should be able to. Do, 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 do. 
Yeah, I've unlocked something for my avatar and something for my player badge, I think. Diddle diddle. Right, blood gulch time. How are, we, how are we doing? It's half an hour already. Maybe I might just maybe I might skip a few. I have a feeling that for anyone new to the Halo series, there are going to be a, uh, lots of people overwhelmed by the amount of multiplayer maps. Kill death ratio That's is going to be terrible, says Paul Burbridge. Okay, here we go. It's um, original Blood Gulch, as seen on Rooster Teeth, Red vs. Blue. And my Xbox the most. Love this map. Played the most matches on this map. I hated snipers who hit up there. Let's have a quick fly around up into the sky. Pretty basic skybox. There we go. It's old school Blood Gulch with a new school. HD makeover. Same old one you know as it is. Try and blow off a car. A warthog even. I kill a warthog, I kill you. Boom. Where's the cave? There it is. Yoink! Oh! <laughs> Whoops! Best thing about this re being re-released is there's going to be a lot more new players to Halo as well as a small experience slot. Hopefully the game will have great matchmaking. Is that correct, Bob? I'm not sure I'm allowed to show the uh, unlocks Gabe Amaya. So I'm not going to. Is there a ranking system? Good question, uh, H. Singh. I'm not sure because I've not been able to get into an online match yet. It's inside the cave system. Flames are in here and an overshield. There you go, apart from the flamethrower, it's pretty much the same blood gulch that he knows and loves from the Xbox. Right, leave. <clears throat> this is where they shot that show, Red vs. Few. Looks very authentic, says Paul Burbridge. This is on Master Chief Collection, Nick Dezeoba. <laughs> if you had a fondness for these Halo games when they were new, then it's easy to enjoy them again. If you've never played Halo before, then getting into the series might be a bit more difficult, says Shuzbot. Interesting. Um, there's a hell of a lot of content here for the price of one game, though. I'd um, I'd recommend if you've never played Halo before, I'd definitely recommend this. Just for just for the amount of gameplay time you're going to get for your money. Uh, what time is it? It's half past. Um, what else have we got? Is there any other big? I'm going to skip some maps. Wizard, longest there is this Death Island, Danger Canyon, Infinities there, Timberland, Ice Fields, uh, Gephyrophobia. That's the last one. I'm going to skip over these ones. If any of you want to see any of these ones, though, let me know in the comments. I might come back to them in a bit. Let's check out some Halo 2 ones. I'm going to go straight into the anniversary ones for Halo 2 before I do the classics. How many maps are there in the classics? There's 25. Okay, there's 25 maps in the classics ones. I'm not going to show them all off. Um, actually, I'll do some of the classic ones first. Um, like my favourite, my favourite map from. Uh, Halo 2 is. Uh, what was it called? Headlong. This is my favourite map from Halo 2. We'll have a look at this quick. 
177 people watching, welcome on, welcome all. If you're brand new, please do subscribe. If you're not brand new, then uh, give the video a thumbs up. You know it makes sense. Shout out to Loz Davis and his son, uh, Ashton. Hello there. Hello, guys. Hope you're enjoying this tour of the Halo maps. Uh, quickly, if you are new and you've never um, seen this before, make sure to follow me on Twitter there, at Ian Higton, and follow Eurogamer on Twitter there as well. You'll get updates on all our live streams, especially our live streams of unreleased games, just like this one. This is... Uh, this is Halo 2. This is my favourite map on Halo 2. And this is called Headlong. Remember driving tanks around Headlong. Having many a, many a battle in here. Trying to land on that with a tank, I think I did. But Halo 2 was the uh, the first Halo that you could go online with, and it was one of the first games that I played online multiplayer with, uh, and uh, I was blown away. It was, um, you know, first that you know console game that I played online multiplayer with. Anyway, uh, and yeah, I was blown away by it. I was I was amazed. I was like, oh my god, this is amazing. This is so much fun. Graphically, it doesn't look like much now, but in the, in those days, and it was when it was in SD as well, it was like, oh my god, it's the future, guys! So yeah, I absolutely, absolutely loved this map. Played, played it all the time, uh, if I could. I played more, um, played more Halo 2 multiplayer than I did Halo 1, just because... Halo 1 multiplayer involved me going around people's houses with a TV and an Xbox and it was a bit of a mission. But Headlong is still looking just as good as it did in the old days. Whee! Plops! So there you go. That's uh, that's what Headlong looks like in the Halo most Oh, let's have a fly up to the top quick. How high can I get? How high can I fly? Only that high. I can only fly this high. Can I stand on that? Go up here and snipe off. Lols. You fools are gonna die! Nice. Right. Let's leave. Game over. Ooh, I think I think I might be able to play some multiplayer in a sec. <clears throat> um, Join that game. Sorry, I've got my big face in. Just seeing if I can join a multiplayer game. Ah, the session is full. Uh, session's full. Well, that blows. Um, let's check out the comments again. So many land party memories, says Chris O'Neill. Hello to anniversary coagulation. Please go into the caves, says Baybok Bayok. Okay. I'm going to use, lose hundreds of hours of sleep and my life to this game, says Nick Desi Beer. Right, okay. 
so what was I doing? Um, all right, I, I'm going to go and I'm going to look at the anniversary um, edition game uh, maps. So these are six maps that have been fully remastered uh, for the Halo Master Chief Collection. I'm going to give you tours of them because I can't get into a multiplayer match at the moment. So there's lockout, lockdown, and then there's lockout anniversary. I'm not sure what the difference is between each two, so we'll have to go and have a look. Let's first look at lockout, and then I'll look at lock uh, lockdown, and then I'll look out uh, look at lockout anniversary and see what the deal is with those differences. So lockdown first. Whoa, 181 viewers watching. Welcome one, welcome all. Tell your friends I'm doing some tours of Halo: The Master Chief Collection's maps. So if you want to see what they look like, uh, this is the place to be. This is um, these are the anniversary editions of the uh, the Halo 2 anniversary edition maps that I'm looking at now. But I can go back and look at some older ones later. Chris O'Neill wants to see the skyboxes in this one. I will I will show you uh, I will show Forge off uh, once I've gone through some more of the maps. So stick with us. I'll be showing Forge in a bit, my lovers. Okay, Team Slayer. Slayer. I'm on the red team. Kill the enemy team to score. Kill the enemy team to score. So here we go. This is Lockdown. Remade, remastered. For the Master Chief Collection. Very similar. Not identical layout, pretty much. Lots more snowy textures added. Lighting effects. There's um, smoky smokes. There's probably some cool name for that, like volumetric smoky smokes or something like that. But I don't know it. Oh, we've got snow falling. Skybox there is. Uh, look at those mountains over there. Bungie Dina. Uh, oh, it's not Bungie, is it? It's but yeah, we've got lovely skybox with um, the rays coming through the, through the clouds mountains with mist in between them. It's looking like a very atmospheric place to get into some battles. I like the way the snow's falling all independent. It's not like uh, just a kind of weird sheet. They're all like wobbling around. I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's go and have a look. There's the grav lift. Whoop! Won't let me down the grav lift. Gonna have to drop down here. So nice, nice lighting under here, and look at this kind of—that's like the a the film Alien, where they go into that room with the eggs. You got the kind of like the floor level fog. What do we got here? We got flood in ch uh, in like stasis chambers. Someone's experimenting on the flood in here. This is cool. If I knock on the glass, does it come alive and go, Kill me! Kill me! Doesn't look like it does. Got a shotgun down here. So that's pretty cool, isn't it? Look at that. Just look look at that for a view. That's really cool. I like that. All the smoke dropping down. Very pretty. Don't worry, guys. I'm going to be checking out Forge after I've done some map tours. It's on my list. I won't forget. Don't worry. So that looked, that looked pretty, uh, pretty nice in there, didn't it? Whoa, look at that guy. Very cool. Another one there. Giant. Giant. Um, flood. Monsters. I was like, when I, when I first loaded up this level, I was like, ah, there's not too much difference. But the, uh, just the added details is really cool. I got the sword. So I think that's enough for this map. Let's um, leave. I'm going to see what the difference is with lockout. Game over. Victory. That was volumetric smoke. That's it. Thanks, uh, John and Bob. The technical term is smoky smokes. My God, I, I think the technical term is smoky smokes as well.
I always love the light dappling effects in Halo, says Peter Gray. How do you do super bounces? People are asking me if super bounces still work. Oh, 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 oh. Right. Map. So, lockdown. I want to see what lockout anniversary is. Because you've got lockdown and then you've got lockout anniversary. I want to see what the two different types are. Whether it's any different or what? I'm, I'm not sure if, it'll have, if there's much difference between the two. But we'll find out now. That's what this tour's for. This is an Xbox One game only. Yes, it is MD Production 07. Xbox One exclusive. They did a phenomenal job on the Halo 2 Anniversary multiplayer remake, says Jeedle. Oh, look up and shoot the ice, says Prime Sniper. Damn it, I read that too late. Played Lockdown at EGX, looked great, says Stewie Boy 16. Lil, Lil Pepperoni says, I will love you long time. Armour show. Kill the enemy I can show the armour off. Score. I can definitely show the armour off. So, is this any different? It doesn't It's not looking any different. Looking up and shooting the ice. Nothing seems to be happening. I'm not really sure what the difference is between lockdown and lockout. Maybe it's something to do with weapon placement. I'm guessing it's to do with weapon placement. No, maybe maybe not even to do with weapon placement. I have no idea then. Oh yeah, there's no shotgun there this time. Or is there? Uh, I don't know. It's a question that will never be answered, at least not by me, because I'm too stupid to know the answer. Yeah, the ice doesn't want to fall down. Right, let's move on. Moving on. You'd have to look it up, I think, talking about the bounce jump. It's a big part of Halo 2, there's lots of tutorial videos. Ah, I don't know how to do them then, I'm afraid. Why no multiplayer matches? Just a walkthrough, says Cloudbusters. Uh, I can't get into any multiplayer matches at the moment. There's only a few hundred people with this game. Um, and uh, it's matchmaking's not uh, working great so far. <coughs> right, a quick. I'm going to do a quick um, armor showcase. Can, wait, can I do armor showcase? I'm pretty sure I can. I'm not sure I can. Hmm. I did say all multiplayer content, didn't I? Yeah. Customization. This is all for the. Uh, this is. These are all the multiplayer characters that you can have. Um, on Halo Anniversary, you can only have that standard guy. Halo 2, um, you can only have two body types as well. Then we get into... oops. Get into Halo 2 Anniversary. And there's three different armors you can have. You can have Mark IV, Centurion, or you can have Hoplite. Halo 3 now, we get a few more. 13 armors to have. Mark 4, QCB, Eva, Recon, Hayabusa, EQD, Scout, ODST, Close Quarters Combat, Mark 5, Rogue, Flaming Head, Security, Katana. Katana, here's the one I used to use for Halo 3 lol. Uh, Halo 4's got a huge amount, it's got 38 armors in it. Air Assault, Aviator, CIO, Commando, Defender, EOD, Enforcer, EVA, Gungnir, Hazop, Infiltrator, Mark IV, Oceanic, Orbital, Protector, Raider, 
ranger, recon, recruit, scout, soldier, vanguard, venator, warmaster, warrior, wet work, operator, pioneer, pathfinder, engineer, stalker, rogue, tracker, deadeye, locust, scanner, strider, photus. Photus is the one I've gone for. Loads of loads of armors to choose from in Halo 4. Alright, let's go back to checking out the multiplayer maps. I'll try and join a game again in a bit. Uh, let's look at Zenith. Actually, let's go. Let's look at Bloodline. Coagulation anniversary map variant most recently played map variant. Built so they're both. They're all the same. So I don't understand what why there's like three different options. Shazbot likes really likes the pace of Halo 4's multiplayer. It's extremely fast paced, faster than the other Halos. If that's what you're into. Oh dear, it's got into a console war in the comments. Everyone's console's just as good as everyone else's, but the Super Nintendo is the best. It's true. Oh, Halo 2 Anniversary also has elites. Press the bumpers. Damn, too late. Sorry, Baybot Park. So this is what Blood Gulch looks like, but now it's Bloodline. Bloodline. And you can see it's had some improvements. Slayer. Kill the enemy team to score. Kill the enemy team to score. Let's find something to fly in so we can have a look at um, skybox actually pretty basic skybox oh look at that there it's the traveller it's not really let's fly up and have a look around blood gulch of the future Ooh. Return to the battlefield. It's looking pretty nice. You've got lots of new, um, well, I didn't say lots of new textures. Which there. We'll go and look inside the bases in a second. I'll have to look around. Rock faces all look um, a lot more you know, organic, realistic. They did on Halo Anniversary, and we just like that texture flat surfaces. That sniper point now is uh, completely different. Lots of trees up here but I don't think you can get in there. No, you can't get in there to hide in the trees. You can't snipe in the trees. Let's land this baby. Textures on, uh, on here are cool. Looks kind of Real rusty. Got a jump, boost jump thing. No teleport though, by the looks of things. Just boost jumps. Let's drop down here. Inside looks pretty awesome. Very rusty and old in this base. Got particle effects, lots of par particles floating around. Got a quick way in and out, jumping through the garbage chute. Doesn't go downwards anymore, it's just um, one flat surface. In here, UNSC. Other no ways up. Can I get up that way? No. But yeah, it's looking very nice, very shiny. All the like the edges are very metallic. It looks like a, you know, it looks like a base made out of space metal that's rotted away. That sends you quite far across the battlefield. Gun Goose. Ah, Lil Pepperoni wants to see the Gun Goose. We've got the Gun Goose in, on this map? I think they do. Gun Goose is a new vehicle, isn't it? 193 people watching. Welcome one, welcome all. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you want to see more Halo the Master Chief Collection. Uh, when this game comes out as well, I'm going to be playing multiplayer and I'm going to be streaming with you guys. I'm going to be holding... Um, I'm going to be making custom maps 
I'm going to be playing custom maps that you guys have made. I'm going to be making custom playlists with you guys. And we're going to be doing lots of multiplayer matches uh, live streamed right here on Eurogamer's YouTube channel. We live stream loads of unreleased games here. Got some, uh, got some Assassin's Creed streams planned for next week. Far Cry 4 streams planned for the week after. Loads of stuff. Lots of good big games coming out. We've got uh, other coverage. Uh, on here, it's not just live streams; it's interviews and uh, gameplay previews, uh, occasional comedy videos and investigations. Loads of stuff here. Uh, lots of stuff worth subscribing for. Let's take a run back here. See if there's a gun goose. Is that a gun goose? That looks to me like it's a gun goose. Let's try it out. There you go. Right trigger to fire. Drive a lot nicer than the uh, old school mongooses. Are they all gun gooses? Trying to take out one gun goose with another gun goose. Shoot his tires out. Smoking. Bits are falling off. Loads of bits are falling off. There we go. Pasted him. He's dead. Right, let's move on to another map. Don't worry guys, I'm going to be showing off Forge mode as well. Just got to be patient. 200 viewers now, we passed 200 mark. Welcome all, welcome all. Thanks for coming along to Eurogamer's YouTube channel and checking out these Halo uh, Anniversary Edition map tours. I'm going through uh, a selection of the maps nice and quickly to give you a look at uh, how they look now. I've shown you, um, if you scroll back through this stream, I went through about 10 of Halo Combat Evolves maps, how they look now. Um, and uh, now I'm checking out some Halo 2 Anniversaries maps. That was the remake of Blood Gulch. I'm going to check out another remake now. Let's have a look. Stone Town, that's Zanzibar, right? Should we go and have a look at... We'll have a look at Stone Town. Uh, Zanzibar is a big favourite of mine. <clears throat> so let's do this. Stone Town, Team Slayer. Love it. Give me a Fe give me a Phoenix pistol and fire sight right now, lol. Is accurate, Bob? The Halo 2 anniversary multiplayer is unique room master to six maps. Of the Halo 2 multiplayer. So that's the show's box. <laughs> laptop gun, people are talking about perfect dark. Laptop gun was awesome. Laptop gun for life, I might get that tattooed on my arm. So, I'm excited to see what Zanzibar looks like. I mean, Stone Town. What's it going to be? Here we go, right, Team Slayer on the remake of Zanzibar. Slayer. Let's do this. Kill the enemy team to score. Kill the enemy team to score. So, graffiti on the walls. Oh, this is inside, um, this is inside, isn't it? Lots of, uh, lots of disrespair going on in here now, lots of broken things. Uh, pouring water. It's all leaky and broken. Played a lot of Halo 3 matches on Zanzibar. The, uh, the Halo 3 remake. Where is the terminal thing that opens the gate? I can't remember. There's a terminal thing that opens the gate somewhere. I'm sure I remember. Is it that? No. Is it in here? Can I go in there? No, probably not. I'm not going to try to go in there. Oh, look, there you go. You have to shoot that this time. There you go. That's open, so now I can get my vehicles in there if I really want to. It's kind of flickering light. Loaded hole in the side here. 
So if people can go in through the side. There's a warthog down there. Let's go quickly out onto this bit. Have a look out here. I like how everything's rusted and old. Uh, how do you drop it? There we go. Shut that down. It's giving me a shortcut over onto here. And to find the rocket launcher. Rocket launcher. Is there, uh, is there the power up in there? No power up in there this time. Let's have a look out at the sky box. Pretty. It's very pretty. Oh, look at that. That's new. Oh, I fell off. Oh. No fall damage, thank the Lord. So, the big spinny fan things. It's still spinning. But the palm trees are still there. Lovely stuff. Have a quick look over in this tower over here, and then I head to the beach. More graffiti. There we go. There we go. Run invisibly. Drop. Okay, looking good. Let's go and head over to the beach, check out the sea. Oh look, that's new. A distant city. Does the rocket interact with the water? Oh it does, it made a little splash. It made a little sploosh when it went in. Oh, not then. Oh yeah it did. Check out this jump. Boing. That delicately plopped me onto here. That's brickwork. Lovely stuff. Have we still got the seagulls that we can practice sniping on or have they have they been remastered out? They might have been remastered out. Can't see any seagulls. No, no seagulls. Let's go for a paddle. Return to the battlefield. Oh, it does look pretty though, doesn't it? I could go on holiday here. Be alright. Oh, wait, what are they? What the hell are they? Ships. Spaceships flying to the city. Oh, no, there's loads of stuff going on over there. Huh. Loads of stuff going on over there. Loads of attention to detail again on this map. Ooh, let's have a quick look in here. Meow 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 Sneaking over here. Yep. I like that. I don't know if you can you saw that there's dust coming off the wall. That's quite cool, the wind blowing the dust. This this the dust, the sand off the wall. It's pretty cool. There's a jump thing there, I think there used to be a dome or something, didn't there? But cool, Zanzibar's looking sweet. Let's leave there. <clears throat> Game over. Victory. Game over. Victory. I won. Yeah, I won, man. Well, what time is it? We're doing an hour now, so... Let's have a look at one more Halo 2 anniversary map. I'm going to be here all day if I look through all the maps. Are people bothered about seeing the Halo 3 maps? Or Halo 4 maps? They're not going to look much different, I don't think. Actually... Let's have a quick... So, Halo 3 maps... Got them all plus DLCs. 24 maps in total there. God damn. Let's have a look at Sand Trap and see if that big vehicle's in it. Have a quick look at Sand Trap. 
And then, um, I'm not going to bother showing off Halo 4 maps, they're, they're not going to look any different. Uh, and then I'm going to do, I'm going to do some, um, some Forge for you guys, because uh, everyone's, everyone's excited to see Forge. Halo has everything, says Crustaceans, epic music, solid single player campaign with full co-op, competitive That's multiplayer, solid. complete with theatre mode and Forge, it does, it does, there's loads of stuff. And we've got over 200 people watching again, so welcome one, welcome all, I am showing off. I'm doing some map tours and I'm just about to do a Forge tour in uh, Halo the Master Chief Collection. You see the Halo 3 maps. Is there's no difference here. There be no difference here. Perhaps some better textures and things. Well, yeah, definitely better textures and things. But uh, it's not like the anniversary modes that have had loads of um, changes done to them. I might come back and check out some anniversary modes. I might try and get into a multiplayer match again with the anniversary modes. There you go. This is Sand Trap. Halo 3. Everything does look a lot higher res actually. The layout's the same, just looks a bit shinier. So drive the elephant around. Right. Okay. Let's look at the forge mode, guys. Game over. I'm not uh, I'm not um I'm not a massive forge user. To be honest, so I'm not going to know what's been, what's new, what's old. I'm going to be a bit rubbish at that, so apologies. Oh dear, sleepy. <laughs> um, theatre. Someone shouted. Choose clip the arc assault. Now these are all um some of those are clips from single player I've been playing. We'll have a quick look at the theatre mode. Those be should be quite quick to launch. <clears throat> so this is gonna show what I played on Stone Town. So theatre mode's good for reviewing your gameplays, for making machinimas, and uh, you know finding out who shot you and how they shot you when you got killed really unfairly, bro. But it wasn't that he totally didn't hit me, bro. Kind of where did that come from? Things. Um, so I'm going to have a very quick look at the theatre mode and then a, a detailed look at the forge mode. I don't like the fact that my MacBook charge is dying. So, Slayer. speed it up a bit. Kill you can, you can speed it up a bit. You can. Can you go back a bit? You can go back a bit. You can't. Just like the old school theatre mode, though, you can't do proper fast rewind. You can do fast forward. You can't really do a fast rewind. Uh, you can take screenshots. I'm not going to name that screenshot, but you can take screenshots. Done. You're done. Okay. That was a point in a screenshot. Uh, how do you go and change camera? There you go. So you can, if you click in the right thumbstick, you can change the camera. Floating around. You can hire it, lower it. And you can watch him over the shoulder camera. Uh, how do you detach the camera? Oh god, no, I don't want to cancel. I keep taking screenshots by accident. Go away.
get out. Let's get him outside. Do 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 do. Machinima says little pepperoni. Get outside a bit. There you go. This is uh, Zanzibar in theatre mode. End film. No, I don't want to end the film. Toggle menu. Can you? I thought you could detach the camera properly, but maybe that's not in theatre mode for Halo 2. Do you think the theatre mode would be the same for all? I can't remember if you could detach the camera completely or not now. Is it Y or is Y done? Y. Can I fly off? Oh, there we go. Y detaches the camera completely. There you go. So now I've got no no HUD or anything. That's, a, that's what you need to press. So if you click on the right thumbstick, it will lock onto your character, but Y will completely detach it. And then you can follow it around. You can speed it up still. Yeah, oh, there he goes. He's running so fast. He's all the way over the place. He's doing some kind of crazy tour. Someone. People will think he's doing a tour of the, of the Halo map pack or something. Oh my god, he's all invisible. He's shooting that thing. He's running over there. He's running down there. He's totally invisible right now. Um, so, yeah, you, you can um, fly all around. Which is pretty cool. Go right up here. You can have a look at everything. Very nice. There I go, look. I'm going to come out of here. Whee. So, loads of fun. Oh. Loads of fun with Halo Master Chief Collections theatre mode. Look at me, I'm just shooting into the sea like some kind of sea shooting badass. Comes coming down. Master Chief Ian was hanging out on the beach one day. He decided to go for a walk. He saw some ruins and he headed inside. But what? What did he see? You'll never know because I'm saving that clip to the game DVR. Do 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 do. Shazbot will get banned if he insults me again. Boop, 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 boop. So there you go, you can see the clip that I recorded there. Lovely stuff. So super high def. Halo 2, Halo 3, Halo 4 machinimas. In the theatre mode. Ooh, lovely. I like that. So there you go. Do, 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 do. Someone says, why won't he listen? Because I can't hear you. You're typing into a window that's like that small. Have patience, angry people. Right, so we're going to look at the forge mode now, right? I'm not, a, uh, I'm not used to doing forge stuff, so again, please have patience. You can do um, you can do Halo Forge on Halo 2 Anniversary, Halo 3, or Halo 4 Forge, for 4 Forge. But we're going to do Halo 2 Anniversary Forge because that's the one everyone wants to see. And um, we'll do it on a map that I've not shown off yet. Let's do it on. Look, there's nine now. Those are new. You can I can play those in my custom mode. These must be um, special ones that you can just build on. Despite the net, so that's quite cool. Let's check out Nebula and see what that looks like. Basic editing. I think we'll do basic editing. Do 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 Rightio, so Nebula. I have no idea what Nebula is. I'm in my head. I'm imagining it's a blank space in in space, blank space in space where you can build stuff, uh, as opposed to the set levels that you could add stuff to. Oh, we're about 
to find out. I'm going to try and go through all the tools. You're on Red Team. Basic a game, a basic object editing with no game specifications. So yeah, we, we yeah we're in the oh so this is cool. So things like Nebula and the other one, the beach one, these are um, complete like blank canvases, I guess. Um, you can put like 650 objects. That's an initial camera. The initial spawn. You can grab objects and move them. Like so. Let's have a look at tools then. Tools. So we've got magnets. You can enable magnets. God knows. God knows. There's going to be a lot of stuff in here that I don't know what to do. Rotation snap is off. Movement snap is off at the moment. Unlock all. Delete by palette, trait zone properties, trait zone alpha. So you can have different traits in all the zones with damage modifiers, sensor modifiers, movement. You can change different, so you can have different zones. So you could have, I guess, that looks like you could have a, like a, a zone where there's like anti gravity and then another zone where the gravity is really heavy, I guess. Um, or zones where you can't use vehicles, maybe. I'm not sure that um, whether that. Is uh, like the whole map or not? Right, place objects. Let's have a look. So you've got weapons, human. You've got all these weapons here. Removable machine gun turret. You got all the covenant weapons that you can add down. You got vehicles, mongooses. So you can have a gun goose and a mongoose. You got different kinds of warthogs. Civilian warthog there. Whoa. Oh, I dropped it. Let's drop another civilian warthog. But let's get it on here this time. So there's a civilian warthog. That's kind of cool. Drop that on there. Um, uh, place object. So you got scorpion, hornet, ghost, wraith, banshees that you can place. Power ups, active camo overshield power ups, speed boost, different gadgets, explosives. Men cannons, man cannons, gravity volumes, trait zones, 32, nice. Teleporters, shields, special effects, what well, special effects? Colorblind, next gen juicy, old timey pen and ink. So you can make it like old timey if you want. I don't want to though. But different kinds of uh, like color effects. Um, Pen and ink, so I could change it to look like a pen and ink if I really wanted. Wow, that's it's blinding me a bit. Let's delete that. Okay, so you got special effects, toys. There's a die. There's a explosive die. Let's drop that down. Big explosive die. Um, golf balls, kill balls, soccer ball, a tin cup. Oh, look at that. So for making a giant game of golf. Let's drop that there. Um, okay, so toys. There's lights as well. You can put your own lighting in. Different amounts of lights. So how do I raise up? There you go, raise up. So I could make a kind of a purple light shine on the uh, on the golf course there. Let's go for map gadgets, switch, EMP devices, we've got glass windows, ice stalactites that we can drop, and that's, that's dripping, dripping with ice, look at that, there you go, um, a power core, oh, that's falling off into space, a garage door, so you can have like, I guess that's going to be interactive, you'll be able to, yeah, there's the switch, so if you shoot the switch, the garage door will come down, so many possibilities and um, there's also a barrier that you can place um, yeah many many possibilities glass window there um, you can duplicate the objects 
it's very easy to duplicate, copy and paste the objects. Oh, I'm in player mode. Whoa! Where, where am I? Oh, I'm over here. I'm going to go into player mode quickly and shoot the dice. You can blow up for me. So this is an explosive die. Okay, so next we're going to look at. Oh. Map gadget. Teleport us. Traits only. Going to volumes. Explosives. Um, gadgets. Scripting. Switches, timers. So you've got switches, timers, and triggers. So you can um, you can make things happen after a certain point of time, or if people jump on them, I guess. You've got spawn points, respawn zones, anti-respawn zones, so I guess places where people don't respawn. Safe areas. Uh, you've got objectives to put in. You've got scenery. Camping stool. But there's going to be loads of scenery to put in, isn't there? Uh, crates, sandbags, street cones, pallets. Oh, not too many... Um, Not too many bits of scenery then, I guess. But there's that palette. Um, let's go back then and check out natural. It's the terrain. So we've got flat, small, large. We've got cliff, large cliff. Whoa! Okay, that cliff's pretty large. Let's um, plonk that down here. Big old cliff. Um, got hills, medium, large. Got a, like a hill there. Let's bring that hill down. Merge that hill into the like that. So you got a hill. Let's place another object. So there's a grass plain. So there's just so that's just flat grass. That's boring. Um. Let's go back. Let's get a small cliff. It still looks pretty bloody big to me. Ah, where are we? Where are we gone? Okay. How do you spin it around? Um. Oops. Grab object. Oh, spawn time. Now you can make it spawn or something. Oh well. Can't bother to work out how to make it spin. Uh, so there is all, the, there's some of the terrains that you can put down there. Uh, you've got rocks that you can place. There's some asteroids. Let's go for a rock spire. Let's go for a, what have we got? A rock arch there. You can have an archway. Oh look at that! That's cool. It affects the um, it affects the items. Boom, ba boom, boom. See you later. So that's cool. Um, what else have we got? Foliage. Trees, 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 dead trees. So we've got lots of trees, and dead trees. Let's whack a tree there. Let's uh, place another object. Let's go for that large tree there. And let's go for the dead tree. The dead tree on the asteroid. There we go. So place object. Foliage, natural. So, uh, structures. The last option. There's building blocks. Many building blocks. Look at all these building blocks here. Four by four, five by fives, ten by tens. Let's go ten by ten. Whoa. Okay, that is a very big building block. Um, there's a ten by ten building block there. Um, we'll have another look. Uh, let's do a, a small, smaller one. Two by two. So lots of building blocks that you can, um, you know, move together, make 
whatever structure you want out of them. Um, oh, place object B. Buildings, uh, bridges, and platforms. Bridge T junction. So loads of different bridges as a dish. So we're starting to get we're starting to get a lot of like ramps and things. Loads of different kind of things to play around with. A Y cross. I have no idea what that is. Um, staircases here. Yeah. So I'm only got th I've got 38 pieces out of 650 so far. So you know you're gonna you're gonna be able to build some pretty detailed um, maps and scenarios in Forge World. That is for sure. Um, right, what else? Buildings. You got your buildings. I'm guessing that all of this stuff is the same as before. These are all objects that you had in the original forge. I, I'm, I've not... Um, I didn't really make very much stuff in Forge. In fact, I made a building shaped like a penis and then I never did anything again. Um, but everyone does that, right? Everyone makes penis buildings? They do, don't they? Or is it just me? Uh, right. Okay, so bunkers and pyramids there. Decorative stuff. We've got antennas. We've got... What's a brace? That's a brace. Um, we've got columns, we've got covers, we've got cover with glass, we've got struts, lots of glass panels. What's a trim? A trim is just like a little thing there. Go away, drop that. Um, what else? What time is it? It's nearly half six. Doors, walls, and windows. Double door. Wall, Colosseum. Oh, big walls. Lots of walls, you've got inclines, you've got a grid as well. There's a grid, I guess that's for helping you place objects. Um, and you've got inclines as well, ramps and things to stick in. So I think that's all the tools, all the, all the items that you can have on Halo 2's one. Not enough explodey dice for my likings, is Peter Gray. Oh my god, pieces are actually flat. This is going to be amazing, says Sam Graham. Cool, cool. Looks like multiplayer is working now. People are playing it on Twitch, says Miss Fraggle Rocks. Cool. Skyward next, please, says Postmodern Pilot. Terrain is the main way to build stuff. Can you add everything, says Travis Statham. Please walk on the grass thing, says Baybok Bark. Okay. Do we know what the third canvas map is like? I'll have a look at the third canvas map as well. I'll just see... Um, where the hell was it? Scenery, was it? No. Natural. Foliage. Oh, no. Terrain. Grass pane. I'm going to walk on the grass thing for bay out. Well, that doesn't seem to be too grassy to me. It's kind of not that grassy at all. But oh well. Right, let's leave this. And let's check out a couple more of the um, over. the canvas levels I think people wanted to watch. Put in some dynamic elephants, a Spartan Bob 117. I'm, I'm, I'm scared I, I won't do it right. I don't really know how to work the dynamic elements or anything like that. <clears throat> this is like Tracy Island on acid, says Peter Gray. I'll try and put some dynamic elements in uh, this next one. So, Halo Anniversary Forge. And we want to look at... So there's Skyward and there's a Wash as well. So we'll have a quick look at Skyward quick look at a wash and then I'll try again to get into a multiplayer match
Oh, we've seen their Blear and a wash, but Skyward is still brand new. Okay, cool. So we've seen a wash, so I won't bother with a wash. I will show you Skyward. Sounds like a good idea to me. Do do. With Forge, I'm going to map some. I'm going to make some crazy maps. People are either going to love or hate. Depends on their sense of humour. Says accurate Bob. Daniel Schweitzer says, "Go player mode, please." On what you built. Ah, oh, damn it! Too late now. Too late. I'll, ma I'll go player mode on on whatever I build here now. Uh, what's what's people saying on Twitter? If you want to follow me on Twitter, by the way, for updates on live streams and stuff, that's my uh, Twitter thing. Totally and you should totally, if you're brand new as well, we've got 220 people watching by the way, if you're brand new um, then please do uh, subscribe to this channel. I'm checking out Skyward now and it's looking very nice. Let's have a look down. So this is actually a very cool um, location. Alright, drop that. Um, we're, above, we're above a very, very beautiful halo ring. You can see it goes all the way up there, and it's is it is that me moving? So yeah, oh, it's, you've, it is. It's the halo ring is rotating slightly, or very gently rotating, which is awesome. Uh, if I look, if if I move closer to this, and then just like keep that as point of reference, the platform there, um, you can see I'm not moving, but the world below is uh, is slowly slowly rotating which is pretty awesome you've got the cloud cover is probably ro rotating a little bit faster um, that's pretty awesome if the, the whole thing rotates all the way around because that's that's massive but yeah it's moving so you'll be you, c you can have these crazy battles maybe you could build like um, an arena with glass, a glass bottom. So below, you can just see everything moving as you're fighting. That'd be that's that's pretty cool. Um, dynamic. What's what are dynamic objects then? Is that something to do with with like switches and stuff? I don't really know. Uh, oh no, I'm not, I'm going to cock it up and just fan it around. I'm not going to know how to do it very well. Um, Oh god. Let's look at this view quick. Look at that, it's slowly moving away. It's really, really weird. Oh, this is beautiful, says Willie Strouser. I was hoping for snow or sand, says Chris O'Neill. Postmodern Pilot says, yes! Looks so awesome, says pa Spartan Bob 117. Oh, yes, says Postmodern Pilot. Um, Travis Statham says, thank you for reading Teamwork. This is probably the skyline for Ascension, says Travis. Literally stunned at how sweet this looks, says um, Accurate Bob. does look beautiful, doesn't it? The way it's all just slowly going off into the distance. Or if I look this way, it'll be slowly coming towards us. That's really trippy. Look to the side, which planet is that? Um, that is, that looks, I don't know what planet that is. Could be any planet, it's huge. It's a big old planet. And there's nothing to the right. There's like some kind of Milky Way nebula thing. Let's drive off. See how long it takes me to uh, die. Oh, we're coming, Halo. I'm gonna finally set foot on a Halo ring. Yay! Oh no, I died. All the way down to the Halo ring. Nice. Got the edge of the uh, edge of the ring there. Yeah, spins. Spinning all the way around. How crazy is that? Looks beautiful. Really does look nice. You know someone is going to record all of the surface to see if it just repeats as accurate, Bob. I'm not going to do that, but the mountains do look lovely. Can't see any structures down there or anything. No, no forerunner architecture or anything. 
Um, Travis Statham's making a gift for everyone. Cool. Um, hold on. Let me, uh, I'll tell you what. If you want to make a gift, Travis Statham, let me get rid of me. And let me... Go here. How do I... I'll, I'll just leave it like that for a sec if you want to make it a lovely gif. I've never seen a map quite like it. That's Halo for you. Always giving us uh, the views as accurate, Bob. Boo -doo -boo 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 -boo. Just letting it. Just, just taking in the beauty for a second. Someone's making a gif. That's probably long enough for a gif, right? Looks nice though. Right, I'm coming back. You're going to see my ugly face again. Hi! Okay, right. Let's leave this. I'm going to leave this now, and I'm going to see if I can get into a multiplayer match. 230 people watching. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't done already. For more Halo Master Chief, um, the collection, uh, Let's Plays and stuff, live streams, all that stuff. Uh, I can, from tomorrow, I can live stream whatever I want from this game, which is pretty cool. It's making me feel a bit dizzy, says uh, Peter Gray. Accurate Bob's going to record the surface in theatre and use it as wallpaper. Nice. Oh, I pronounced uh, Jip's gifts. Oh. Right, so what am I doing? I'm going to try and get into a multiplayer mode again. Uh, how am I doing that? <clears throat> and try and join someone who's playing it. That's what I'm going to do. Let's try and join this guy. Join. Game. Session is full. Let's just see if I can find a game. It probably won't. It'll probably just hang on this again, I reckon. This is beautiful, perfect for making ships, says Chris O'Neill. Looks so cool in detail, says Spartan Bob117. Love the moment of silence for the Halo, says Accurate Bob. Do do do, show us the heretic banshee. And see if there are any other new vehicles, please. I don't think there are any other new vehicles, Sam Graham, but I will go and check again for you. Uh, I'm not going to find a game this way, I don't think. Uh, what are we doing, Forge? Let's... Wait, would the Heretic Banshee, would that be in, that would be in like, Forge, Halo 4 Forge, right? I don't think there's going to be any new vehicles because this is a um, except for the gun goose, which I've shown off already. Do, 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 do. Everyone thinks forge is the most important thing. Got lots of map makers uh, watching by the looks of things, so welcome map makers. Uh, if there's anything else you want me to show off in forge mode, let me know. Resolve Demesis here, says Halo, Halo, Halo. Cavs here as well. Skyward, Skyward and Nebula are kind of uh, the canvas maps, I guess. They're uh, little empty areas for you to build. Rather than uh, these kind of forged places, uh, these are, you know, these are already made arenas or areas that you can just add stuff to in forge mode. Skyward and Nebula are blank canvases. Let's have a look. Um, vehicles, wasn't it? Mongoose. So you don't get a gun goose in this one. Wraith. What was it you wanted to see? Can't remember. Now. Banshee. I don't think. Um, 
The heretic banshee. Is this the heretic banshee then? Let's see if I can get in it. Heretic Banshee. Sounds a bit nicer. Whoa. It's kind of got like an armor. There's a, I, I believe that's a heretic banshee. It's my educated guess. Oh, it's in Halo. Oh, it is in Halo 2. Okay, I apologise. What are the um, what are the aren't they? What are the Covenant in uh, Halo 4 then? They're like Victory. they're like a splinter group, aren't they? But I can't remember what they're called. Oh, I don't know. Let's go back to Halo 2 then. Halo 2! The different covenant. Um, what is it? Fanatics or something, isn't it? Do, 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 do heretic banshees only in Halo 2. Okay, cool. Okie doke! Halo 2! Uh, it gives me a good excuse to go and. Hey, come on, you. Gives me a good excuse. God damn it. Gives me a good excuse to keep fumbling. Uh, gives me a good excuse to check out a wash. Let's go. Forge is important that it's going to give an infinite, in, uh, infinite number of new maps, modes, and game types. It's. Bob says. Wesley Staff 907 on Twitter says he's watching me do Halo Master Chief stuff live on the Xbox One YouTube app. Nice one, yo. Thanks for spreading the word. Beep, beep, beep. Bleep. Right, where are we going? Comments. Where have the comments gone? Okay, okay. Right. Okay, right. We're on the right track now. Objects. Vehicles. Banshees. Oh, here we go. Heretic Banshee. There you go. That's what we was looking for. I got all confused, so we're going. We'll we'll fly down and we'll have a. We'll, I'll I'll go round it. We'll go around and have a look. There he is. That. There's the heretic banshee. Try not to make it glow green, so you can see the, the proper colours of it. It's pretty nice. Looking nice, eh? That smooth camera control there. Very nice. Some of my practice from using jib cams when I used to work in TV. You know, those big cameras on, on sticks that you see at big events and stuff. I used to use them. Well, say them. I used to use one of them. It was a rubbish one. But I could still use it. So there you go, Heretic Banshee. Let's get in it and have a fly around a wash here. Oh god. I saw that out.
fly around in my heretic banjer. Oh no! Pretty shallow um, ocean to find out. I broke it. Can't take that. Doesn't seem to have a secondary fire. Okay. That gets me out of it again. I catch it. Oh. So it's pretty, it's a nice pretty banshee, but I'm just it's, it's getting killed on this really hard floor. Let's do some stunts. Do a barrel roll. Can I do a barrel roll? Something like to do a barrel roll? No. No. There we go, do a barrel roll. Steagle Bob the Fourth is liking it. Right, so goodbye, pretty banshee. Oh, it died. So huge amounts of potential for Halo Two Forge. Lovely. Oh, little pepperoni wants to see the civilian hog again. I can do that for you. It's one of the golden wart hogs. Oh, uh, yep. No guns on this, baby, but um, got a spare tire in the back. And it's a winch. It's a sporty number. I wonder if it goes faster than the other warthogs. Let's uh, let's get in and give it a spin on the water. Yeah, boy. Oh, look, there's that bunch is back. The, uh, this is me driving the civilian warthog. Pretty nice. For a shack shake. But, does it blend? I don't know. But does it blow up? I don't know. Because I've got no grenades left. Time is I've got 15 minutes left. Um, I'm going to try and get into the multiplayer again quickly. Although I don't think I'm going to have too much luck. So if not, I'll show off another um, another one of the Halo 2 anniversary Game maps, over. the Victory. remade ones. Do 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 do. do. Lots of people watching today. Thanks for coming along, guys. Um, if you're brand new, don't forget to subscribe. Maybe give this video a thumbs up as well, uh, especially if I've shown off something you wanted to see. Um, the solid water seems a rather odd choice, to say the least, as Sandmore. Maybe it's just really shallow, Sandmore. The water is a foot deep in case you want to make streams, says Travis Statham. I don't think you can change the colour, Lil Pepperoni. No, I didn't see any options to change the colour. Um, roster friends. Oh. Guess 
guess I'm going to miss out on this uh, multiplayer sesh. Join that game, yo. Come on, let me in. Let me in, man. Let me in. Let me in. One game. Come on, let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in, man. Let me in. Let me in, bra. Damn you. Damn you, bra. Damn you. Oh well, it's fine. I don't mind. Let's have a look at Warlord Shrine. Let's have a look at Shrine. I don't really know Shrine. I can't remember what Shrine is. We'll have a look around Shrine. Ian just spawned some frags. I should have done Shrine. Um, that was me uh, humming the Halo music. Now we know who the Stig is, says Drunk Dougie. It's me all along! Lol, 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 lol. So we're going to have a look. This is the final thing I'm going to have a look at. I'm going to have a look at the shrine. I'm in Forge mode, so I'm going to. Might have a fiddle around, try and make something explosive. <clears throat> I showed off armor customization um, earlier, Spartan Bob. You, if you re rewind the stream a bit, um, it was around the point where I was showing off Halo 2, uh, where I started doing, I think it was after the second or first map I'd shown off of Halo 2 Anniversary Edition. Oh, I, oh, I've seen this map. I've, I've seen this. They've demoed this. It looks very pretty, mind. But I've seen a demo of this map before. So I'm going to load a different one. That's nice, though, how the water reflects on the... Uh, the sun reflects on the water, though, isn't it? You've got all these waterfalls over here as well. I think. I'm pretty sure. What's that there? What are these things? Not allowed up there. Pretty sure there's something you can shoot on here that makes all the water come down as well. There you go. You shoot that and it makes the water come down. Look at that. You can't see me now, right? And it goes down there. That's pretty cool. Sploosh. I'm having a shower. Sploosh. Nice. But I've seen this map before. So I want to try a different map. Can we see the flood on Halo Combat Evolved at some point? What's the flood? Like the actual bad guys? I'm not allowed to show off um, that until tomorrow, I'm afraid. From tomorrow, I can stream whatever I want. Whatever I want from this game. But at the moment, I'm tied down to a few kind of restrictions. Halo 2 Anniversary Pool. Okay, Warlord. Let's do this. Let's go, Warlord. Let's forge this. Forging my Warlord. <clears throat> yeah, do you... Uh, yeah, oh my god, dude. How did you get a background on your Xbox One Dash? Uh, yeah, it's you have to be part of the preview program. Or can you do it anyway now? It's very easy to do it. So this is a uh, an evil within um, picture that I got from doing a, a challenge on evil within. Uh, but it's very easy. Uh, all you have to do is go to your achievements. You see, you can import pictures as well. Um, I thought this was available for everyone, but I guess not. Um, so you go in to your um, your achievements, or you do a USB stick with a picture on. You find an achievement with a cool picture, like say that one where that dude is shooting a building, and you click on it, and then you can just set as background, and it sets it as the background picture, and then uh, and then you're done. It's your background picture. But I quite like the contrast of the red and the green. Red and the green. Red and green should never be seen except for on my dashboard, yo. Right, so this map, anyway. 
Finish us the new shotgun and magnum in Forge, says Lil Pepperoni. Don't see why not. Oh, it's a remake of this map. Uh, very small map, this one. Not so crazy about Okay, remake of a um, magnum. Uh, stop it. Is it the, the Survivor Magnum or the normal Magnum? I guess maybe the Survivor Magnum. Well, I'll put that Magnum down there. I'm going to place the Survivor Magnum. I'm going to place... What was the other one? The Shotgun, I think it was. A wash gift with Banshees is now on our Halo, says Travis. Uh, Statham. Travis Statham, can you, um, I want to see the gifts you made, can you, um, could you tweet me the links to that Twitter name there, by any chance? If, you t if someone can tweet me a link to uh, that Twitter, that'd be awesome, otherwise I'll look at that once I've finished packing up the street, but uh, a link would be awesome if you can do that, y'all. Uh, at Ian Higton, I-A-N-H-I-G-T-O-N. So I'm going to drop this shotgun. Um, so, and the survivor shotgun there as well. I'm going to drop the survivor shotgun. And, and I'm going to go human mode. So, this is a survivor shotgun. How's that different to the normal shotgun? Not that different. It looks. I can't really see any any discernible difference between the survivor shotgun and the normal shotgun, to be honest. They look identical. Well, let's have a look at the magnums, see if there's got any difference between the magnums. And survivor magnum. Oh, it's dual wield. There we go. Uh, they both look identical. Both look the same, yeah. This is Warlord, which came from Warlock, says Travis. Yeah, if you can stick the links, not in the um, YouTube comments, Travis, but if you can send them, if you're on Twitter, uh, if you can send them to my Twitter, that would be awesome. But if you can't, never mind. Uh, so, yeah, that, I'm going to leave it there, guys and girls. It's coming up to the two-hour mark now. So, I think I've shown off um, I think I've shown off a good amount of uh, Halo 2 Anniversary Edition's multiplayer content. Sorry, I couldn't actually show you any multiplayer matches, but we've been able to do a thorough explore of the Forge mode and the Anniversary maps and um, some of the, uh, the Championship Edition maps. Had a bit of a nostalgia burst. Uh, it's been a pretty cool, it's been a fun two hours, it's flown by, I've really enjoyed showing uh, all this off to you. Um, so I will do Travis Statham. So uh, yeah, thank you very much everybody for coming along and watching. If you want to see more Halo The Master Chief Collection, I'm probably going to stream some more tomorrow, hopefully we'll be able to get into some multiplayer games tomorrow. So make sure you subscribe for Halo streams and plenty more stuff. The Eurogame YouTube channel does loads of stuff, so, and uh, we always do uh, live streams here. So uh, make sure to come along and uh, tune in next next stream. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. I'll do some shout-outs quick. Shezbot, Travis Statham, Killer, Kill J, Mechanized Warpigs, Lil Pepperoni, Mr. Lorden, Andy Jackson. Sorry, Mr. Jackson. Ooh. Uh, who else have we got? Uh, Peter Gray... Lots of the same people commenting. John John Blomberg, John and Bob 87. Still not managed to get into the mic, I'm afraid. John and Bob. Daniel Cliftlands, Drunk Dougie, uh, Fly CFs, and everybody else. Thank you very much for watching, commenting, liking, and subscribing. You guys have been awesome. I'll be back tomorrow with more Halo The Master Chief Collection streams. Goodbye!